Dear viewers, welcome to another episode of Jammer Informs. Today I am going to talk about MVVM and data bindings. MVVM is model view, view models, pattern that helps to cleanly separate the business and presentation logic of an application from, this, from its user interface. For explain that, I have created a simple page. Here you will find a text box for item name and another text box for price and a button and a label. If I click on this button, input a item name. If I click on this button, it displays saved item name mouse price 300. Here the button click event, uh, the message is saved item name and the item name and the price is get from this control. If I change the name of item name control the presenter logic will be break. So my UI and code behind page is tightly coupled. So how do you fix that? We can create a bridge between UI and code behind page. For that, I will create an object which bound the UI control and access from the code behind. So I don't have to access the control, only need to access the object. This approach called MVVM. We have already a view and the object I have talked about is view model. So let's create a view model. item info view model this will be public item name item name and price so now we have a view model so how can I bind this view model with a UI? For that, we have to we have to add namespace Xamarin app, and we have to bind content paste binding context item info view model this bound our view model into this UI let's bound the property into this control For bound, just text, we have to binding, item name, also biting, price. So, we don't need to access the control in code behind, in this button click, for this, for that we have to Convert this binding context into item info view model and take this into a local variable. Then we can use this local variable.
okay let's run this application okay cool set so, item name laptop price 50000 now now we can also bind this even for that we have to remove this code from here i will just cut this code and just paste this here just submit remove this code and we have to create a command And use this command so remove this clicked to create a command binding this submit command if I click it will call this command it is call this function still there a error how can i solve that for that we have to add a property message and we have to bind this message into this level debug point just run this application okay just click this button let's fire this command and if I debug we'll find this message save the item lap top and price just run this you will see the message did not populate it because we did one way binding we got all the values from ey and put in view model put into this view model but when we update our view models we did not update our view so how can I solve that for that we have to take i notify property changes and implement this and i will copy and paste on property chains event if property chains it will invoke and update our ui for that we have to change the message getter setter I'm 
want to take another property return messages and set this message equal to value and we have to call on property change function so let's run this application okay now it's displaying the message in this process we can binds our ui into view model that's all about mvvm and data bindings thanks for watching my video